What's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. Tiger Kim here from Tiger Family Life. Today I got some healthy stuff here. You can see or kind of see I got uh, pasture raised and boiled eggs, avocado, green pepper, um, some cabbage slices here. Check it out. It's all been chopped up. So I make my own salad. Boom. Put that in. And then we got some organic lettuce. Whatever you call it. Ooh, almost grabbed everything. Bam. Then you got some pasture raised chicken meat. Now, so if you wanted to go all vegan or whatever, it's minus this, you got all vegan. But you know me, I'm a tiger. I gotta eat my meat. Boom. Then you got some tofu. Check it. Grilled tofu. Put some tofu in here. Some of that. Ooh, then you got some beans. Some beans, check it out. You got some, put some beans. I don't even know if I'm doing too much or what, but boom. Then you got, you gotta slice some egg. Let's see. Bam. Let's do two. This is how mama eats. What is this? Chia seed. Oh my goodness. That's like super healthy stuff. Let's get a scoop of that. I don't know. This might be too healthy for me. Scoop. Ooh. Looks weird. Looks weird. What is this? What did I say? Hemp seed. Mmm. I might become like Arnold after all this. Two scoops of that. I don't know. I just felt like doing two. Okay. And then, and then, you got pumpkin seed. All these seeds. Good for you. Got to floss your teeth though after this. Because all this is going to get stuck on the machine. Stuck in between your teeth. Then I love my I love making my own dressing, balsamic vinegar. Just, just pour this. It's really healthy for you. Pour it around. And then you go with extra virgin olive oil. Damn, what's wrong with this? Oh, uh. So then we got extra virgin olive oil. Organic extra virgin olive oil. Very, very good for you. So good that I can just drink it. Not. Nah. It is good for you though. Just pour it in. Pour it in. Won't die. Nobody's ever died from drink eating olive oil. So, all good. Then you gotta mix it up. Check it out, guys. Before I mix it up. Boom. You like that? You like that? Mix it up. Let's see. My utensil today. That mix it good. Get that balsamic vinegar and olive oil. All mixed in. Get the bottom ones up. And now, you're ready for a Ooh, this is healthy, baby. Everything. Everything good. I'm gonna feel powerful after this. Kill the virus after this. Alright. Check it out, guys. Boom. Alright, 
All right, so here we go. What's going on? Um, first bite for you guys. I don't even know if I can get you guys a first bite, but here we go. Oh. Mm, that's good. Okay, now that we've cooked, we're eating, let's chat. Okay, so what's been? You guys know this virus is going crazy now, okay? Me, I'll give you a little update on Washington. Schools finally all closed. They just announced yesterday the restaurants, any bars. It first started with any um, 250 people or more gatherings. Not recommended. Now they put that down to 50, uh, 50. and then the White House today announced that um, they don't recommend 10 people or more to gather together. Um, isolate, you got a six foot rule, stay away from other people. Uh, some parts of the country, San Francisco just announced that they are going to uh, shut down the city. Um, What's happening in Washington? The restaurants are all down now. Only they can do only carry out to go. It's gonna. I mean, like I said last week, this week is gonna be crucial on what happens, and it's already started. The market is already tanked. Um, a lot of people are panicking in Washington now. Uh, it's hard to go into even Costco to go shop. There's like a bunch of empty shelves in a lot of supermarkets for all the needs that people think they're gonna need if it goes on lockdown. It's kind of scary. So, what does it mean when it goes on lockdown? I have no idea. They say you can still go to work. Obviously, a lot of restaurants are going to be closed. I guess you don't have really much to go but supermarket. But I don't know how the businesses and the employees will be able to survive. How do you survive? Is the government going to help out? I don't know. Mm. What do we do? I think here in Washington State or nationwide, sometime this week, every place is going to be on lockdown. Um, they might deploy the National Guard or the Army to come out to help out with law enforcement. But basically, the quickest and fastest way to kill this virus from spreading is a lockdown. Because you go lockdown for like two to three weeks, whoever's sick, gonna recover, they can't spread to nobody else. And then if you're on lockdown, you can't get it because you're on lockdown. So country just might have to suffer two three weeks and this will be all over big major supermarket chain said that they're gonna stay open and they probably will but they're hiring a lot of people I'm gonna have to go get a job at Safeway or something. Oh, what would I do there? Make YouTube videos. Title would be <laughs> Safeway lockdown during lockdown at Safeway. I don't know. It's scary though. I mean, I feel bad for it. 
you know, lower income individuals or family households that barely make it through and all of a sudden they're going to get their hours shrunk or they get laid off, you know, and they can get unemployment, but it's not as much and they got rent due or mortgage due, meals to eat, pay for, bills to pay, and no money. And everybody's affected by this. Everybody. Like, what do you do? Only you can do right now is prepare for the worst. It's gonna be lockdown though. Now they all trying to say what's up now. Yeah, they all trying to say what's up now. Now they all trying to say what's up now. I'm a blow up, I ain't gotta rush now. I ain't gotta rush now. I'm gonna be crazy. I ain't gotta rush now. This is good. I ain't gotta rush now. Get a lot of cat food, dry food, egg. You can get bread too at the store. If you get a lot of bread, just put it in the freezer. When you need it, take it out. It'll last longer, it won't go bad. I need a little bit more of the balsamic flavor. Mm -hmm. This is delicious though. I hope all you guys stay safe. So I want none of you guys to get hurt or get the virus. That'd be horrible. And you can spread it to your loved ones so too. That'd be horrible too. Oh, I love this, man. Feels so clean. Very juicy. You just know you're feeding your fat, your body some health. Delicious. That red beep is going off. This is too big. Let's try to use a spoon here. Eat the rest. Mm. 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 All the beans, seeds, the chicken. So good. Maybe it might not look good, but it's good. Oh my god. Mm. You gotta eat this, man. If I ate like this every day, I'd probably lose like 30 pounds. Look at that. All the bell peppers. Oh, yeah. And when you go to the grocery store, don't buy too much toilet paper, okay? You're not gonna have to wipe your ass that much. People are going nuts on that toilet paper. 
And besides, if you don't have toilet paper, you use water, man. Water and soap. You gotta need food to survive. Not no toilet paper. This is really healthy stuff. I feel healthy. So I predict, I predict by Wednesday or by Friday, Washington State or the whole nation is going to shut down. It's gonna be a good time for you to bond with your family. Spend lots of time with them, you know. And um, realize the time that you haven't spent with each other. It's gonna be um, precious moments that we're all gonna go through. I'm gonna make, I'm gonna try to make like two videos a day. Maybe three. Something. Wash your hands, wash your hands good. Try to isolate yourself or within, within the family, okay? Stay with the family, try not to go out, interact with people. You gotta stop this virus, so. If you have it or you don't have it, you don't wanna get it, you don't wanna give it away. <laughs> Stay calm. The next three, four weeks, take care of yourself. Take care of your family. And try to get through this in the best positive attitude way possible. We're all gonna get through it. We're all suffering. The whole whole world, the whole world is affected by this. So it's not like just our country, or it's not you, or it's not you know why me. Okay, so we're gonna all get through it together. Hang in there, and um, always thank you very much for watching. Always believe in yourself. Never give up on your dreams, and you can do anything with God. Till next time. Hope you enjoyed it. Peace. Now they all trying to say what's up now. Yeah. Now they all trying to say what's up now. Now they all trying to say what's up now. I'm a blow up. I ain't got a rush now. I ain't got a rush now. I ain't got a rush now. I ain't got a rush now.